guys, welcome back. And if you need your welcome as well. So I have to give a huge thank you to um, Nate who reached out to me to tell me about, he had messaged me being like, so are you gonna you know, react to the Slingshot episodes? And at first I was like, what the hell is he talking about? Because I literally had no idea. And then he explained to me that I guess there are some shorts that I need to watch before episode nine. And I guess it's little ventures that of what, you know, um, Daisy and Yo-Yo have been up to. So I'm definitely going to do those. And then I did actually see somebody like two episodes ago, two or three episodes ago, somebody had um, commented on one of the videos being like, so are we going to tell her about the slingshot episodes? But so yeah, I'm already on it. Um, I saw they're very short, so I'll do a couple at a time. But yeah, I'm really excited to see like what they're all about. Um, and then as you can see, um, I am finally in a recording room. It's finally ready. No longer have to film at the edge of my bed. Um, I do give this little speech because I did just film the next episode of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. So that's going to be coming out very soon as well. Um, so I go into more detail there. So I won't, you know, go, I won't make you guys listen to it twice. But yes, okay, so here are some of the Slingshot episodes presented by Geico. Oh, okay, so Daisy's still at S.H.I.E.L.D. That bag owe you money. I'm just trying to get back to my old routine. It's quiet here in the mornings. But not when you play music like that. Macy's gonna wanna grill you about your time off. Wait, hold on. Is it before episode nine, right? Why does it seem like she came back? Okay, okay. Just need to double check, make sure he didn't actually say after. <laughs> so maybe we should get our story straight about that night. Oh! Oof. How much do they know? Not much. Colson had just stepped down and we thought we'd oh, never see you again. Maybe they just went out, got really drunk. Oh! Que se esta vaina? Don't know why you hold on to that thing. What is it? It's my good luck charm. Oh! <laughs> I heard Mace was calling you in. Oh, God. You're signing the Sokovia Accords. It's a big step. Yeah, one you never made me take. Secret warriors, you said. Whatever happened to secret? New boss, new rules. Ugh. I miss the old boss. They all do. They all do. Now you can work with me instead of for me. Okay. Positive. I've been tracking this criminal from my country. This man, he, uh... Hey. Take it to Mace. Oh. That's the procedure now. <laughs> Guy's got it hard enough without me stepping on his toes. But you're the one I trust. But I had to earn that trust. Give him a chance. I still I don't know about him. Is that picture of Stan Lee? They handed those out at the formation of S.H.I.E.L.D. That one in particular belonged to Agent Peggy Carter. Oh. Can't think. That's and just hold that on. That is it something. For me. I'll only lose track of it on the Zephyr. Oh, you wouldn't, but. Strange to think I'm going to be sleeping on a plane again. I honestly don't think Mac will fit. <laughs> I hope you find her, sir. Me too. I was angry and reckless. Oh. I couldn't let the men who killed my cousin walk free. Ugh. But I had no idea what he'd stolen or how dangerous he'd become. That makes you go into Terragenis. <laughs> oh, okay. Bienvenida, Miss Rodriguez. Es un placer con serla. Su servicio en English is fine. <laughs> <laughs> Fast learner. Heard that about you. That'll make this much easier. Oh, he was trying. Look. Getting to know me, huh? There's <laughs> no substitute for a face to face meeting. Thanks for coming. Not like I had much time. That would kind of creep me out. All my shoes. Just I've lost to follow and a difficult job to do, but I think you'll find that being an official asset uh -oh. has its benefits. But I'm getting ahead of myself. First, I'm gonna need your John Hancock. He's so weird sometimes. Fantastic. And your thumbprint there. And a retinal scan. Damn. 
I can't wait to work with you. It'll be fun. Oh, well, there's no need to when wait. When you say it like that. There's an escaped convict coming here from Colombia, and he's an arms dealer. Good, good. Love the enthusiasm. Can't wait to dig in. <laughs> but the first step is to submit a detailed threat assessment. Oh, my lord. Of approval from the UN. We verify there's no conflict of jurisdiction, and then we discuss strategy. Okay, but when do I go catch him? If the strategy turns out to be you. Oh. The powers that be get twitchy when enhanced individuals choose their own missions with Quake out there. Daisy has nothing to do with this, sir. But she's the example of what not to be, a vigilante. <laughs> Your role is to act as a measured response to enhanced threats. And if I went anyways? So you know that if you break the agreement, the law states I have to turn you over to Secretary Ross and he won't hesitate to detain you on the raft for the foreseeable. <laughs> I don't like boats. It's not really a boat, it's more like a floating prison. Perfect. I guess you kind of have to put them, yeah, in a prison like that. <laughs> Agents Fitz and Simmons will finish your registration and I can't wait to read about your Colombian arms dealer friend. <laughs> She got the, she got the little pass thing. I know she did. She's about to, oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, didn't see that coming. But yeah, the only thing is kind of weird that like, if you go against the Sokovian Accords that like you automatically just get sent to that prison. I was like, <laughs> I feel like there should be some type of, <laughs> you know, like what if it was for a good reason or, you know what I mean? Like they, I don't, they, they don't get a trial. Like, you know, I don't want to say normal people, but you know what I mean? Normal people. <laughs> and plus like he had to have known, right? Like they know where her powers are. So they know she could easily do something like that. But I guess they're just going off the trust, you know, <laughs> when it comes to that. Me? Whoa. Bridget would be the perfect Bridget. scientists are like, why why is it's she like touching our computers? She would consume over half our bedroom. I mean, what if it fell over? We'd be dead. <laughs> yeah, but it's 80 inches. 4K OLED HDR. That's just the way nature intended it to be. Uh sharing a room on base requires a bit of negotiation. <laughs> <laughs> they do seem like they would have like different styles. Oh good god. That that is ballsy. <laughs> That was ballsy. Have you guys thought about moving in together? Outside the base. An apartment. <laughs> Perhaps a breakfast snack. Who could live without one? So that's how that came about. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for that. She's gonna be obsessed now. Obsessed. <laughs> be happy about that now um if you take that off we will know and we will send the rescue team so just don't do that perfect so how's she gonna get around that how's she got away with that <laughs> god damn just i'm still waiting for these to two to make off. out you're just gonna let me leave without saying goodbye are you going after daisy again where are you headed well, Intel says she's on the East Coast. Can so you at least hug? Be excited. Just hug. It means I get to see you more often. Oh! oh! And, I don't know. Maybe I could take you out to dinner sometime. So, is this going to show, like, the little breakdown of this, I guess? Mm. Something. Yeah, I mean, is. even if it's just a hug. Ugh, so close. But I'll take it. They do not bang at some point. I'm gonna lose it. I will lose it, guys. Not in the, the shorts, but I mean like the actual, you know, show. Or in the show, you know, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Turns out the director's credentials are missing. <laughs> I have a theory where they are. Ma'am, you didn't like zoom it back as soon as you were done? God damn, girl. <laughs> oh, I thought for sure she would have done that. Okay, so yeah, I'll just do the, the first three and then I'll, I, I, I'm not sure exactly how many, but you know, I'll do the next couple, you know, here soon. But <laughs> yeah, so it is kind of cool to get to see like the little in between and you know, how things kind of unfolded like better. No, that's actually really cool. I like that they did this, but yes, 
come on, I want Mac to be happy, I want Yo-Yo to be happy. They're not, because any couple that like, something bad happens, so now, shall, I guess I just gotta start preparing for like her to die. I guess he could die, I don't know. I feel like it might be her though. Uh, you know what, I'm dying to get excited. I hope they don't hook up. You know, I don't, I hope they don't hook up because what's the point? It's just gonna crush my heart later. <laughs> uh, but yes, okay, so until next time guys, bye.